we're back with our series of life lessons. Almost time for those holiday parties and gatherings. And this morning, we are going to talk through some do's and don'ts with an etiquette expert. This is author of Modern Etiquette Made Easy, Mika Maya. Hello. Thanks Thank for coming Hello. Back. Good morning. Thank you so much. So here's the thing. We've got these cute little gift boxes. We're going to take a question out of the oh, gift box. Yeah. Look at that. And then this is how we'll play. All right. No question. Oh, yeah. I'm hosting a party. It can be stressful. What are some ways to reduce the stress while giving guests the best holiday party experience? Okay, so first think about the type of party you're having, the number that you want to have at your house. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ask if the if you want, do you want to give that person a plus one or not? Very specific. Mm -hmm. And then make sure you put an RSVP date by. So you're not getting those last minute right. RSVPs, right? You want to be very careful about that. But also, I always say go in and try to tickle the five senses. Mm -hmm. When your guests first come in, it's my favorite hosting trick. So is there something smelling when they walk okay. in? Are they greeted? The touch, right? Think about the I festive music, that. the decor. Mm -hmm. So try to do, hit the five senses and you'll be an amazing host. Good tips, I love Micah. That. Good tips. Okay, I've got another question. Question number two. Micah, how can we be better guests this holiday season? <laughs> ah, RSVP. Yes, RSVP. Yeah. Exactly. So you think you're you're you think you're having good etiquette by showing up early, but actually it's about very ten annoying. minutes late or late mm -hmm. past invitation time is the right time you to show up. Oh, I was about to say I'm perfect. <laughs> <laughs> it's very stressful when someone gets there early. Yes, you hear the ding dong. Yes. And you're like, like yeah, entertain them. Exactly. And you say never arrive empty-handed. Still mm -hmm. do hostess gifts. It is so important. So I will say you should have all of your hands so full that you mm -hmm. have to use your elbow. To ring that doorbell because you're coming to show gratitude for being invited. That's oh, nice. Nice. I like that. And dress to impress, huh? Make sure to dress to impress. So mirroring the effort of the host. Well, because that shows that you put care. some effort into exactly. it. Because they it's did. a lot of work. And then and what's, the no yeah, what's up with the no phone? So what I always say, when you're at a party, then you go off. You go offline, and that is the correct etiquette. So once somebody pulls out their phone, everybody pulls out you're their right. phone. Yeah. Okay. I've got my question here. What kind of gift is appropriate to bring to a holiday party? All right. Beware of anything with sizing. Yeah. If it's one size fits all, fine, but you could offend somebody. So you want to be careful. Hmm. Also, give a gift receipt. That's a big okay. one. So they don't have that awkward, oh, can I, you know, yeah. exactly. And if you don't know somebody's religion, just happy holidays. Perfect mm -hmm. card rather than a specific religion to the card. Okay. And I have a quick bonus question here. I got two gifts. <laughs> um, sometimes get togethers lead to unwanted or awkward conversations. Mm -hmm. What are ways to politely avoid these tricky moments. Okay, this is called the holiday handoff, which if somebody's talking about something you don't want to talk about, you could say, you know, not so sure about that one, but let's talk about Shane's recent trip to mm. Hawaii, oh, whatever you want okay. to, um, you can kind of pass it off, the holiday that's handoff. That's cute. And let them tell you. So you, everybody has that person that says, so are you having a baby? So when are you getting married? Mm -hmm. So you don't want to ask such specific questions. Right. Let the person decide what they want to tell you. Okay. I love that. And, and I like the go-to I like questions. to have a few go-to two questions just in your pocket for those awkward moments exactly what's the highlight of of next year for you what are I, you looking for i like to start i like to start with who are you voting for yeah. <laughs> okay. uh, Micah, thank you hey thanks for watching don't miss the today show every weekday at 11 a.m eastern 8 pacific on our streaming channel today all day to watch head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here